There's a beautiful quote from uh, The Will to Power by Nietzsche where he says, we have art lest we perish of the truth. So in philosophy you can't say there's no such thing as truth because um, that's one proposition that purports to be true that all other propositions are false. You see how it contradicts itself? So you can't say there's no such thing as truth, so Nietzsche gets around it by saying we have art, you know, this myriad uh, language uh, that can say everything, um, lest we perish of the truth that there's no such thing as truth because we can't say that. I think that it's actually this concept of truth and that we could know truth that has caused a lot of um, uh, pain for our culture and our society and our planet and the universe. And the problem is that we're not relativistic, meaning that I, as human beings, you know, we look down our nose at other people who have different truths. And even worse, you know, the, if you look at the Crusades or you look at Christopher Columbus or uh, you look at, you know, people, anybody who colonizes goes into some place and says, do you take Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior? And then the Indians are like, what are you talking about? And we kill them, right? So um, this concept of truth uh, really, you know, needs to be replaced by Accuracy. Is this an accurate depiction of what's happening in reality rather than saying, oh, that's true and it's true for all eternity and America is the greatest nation and everybody has the right to guns and all the other things that people believe are true. You know, um, the world would be a much more peaceful place if we could be um, relativistic and understand that, uh, you know, the way you see reality is different from the way I see reality and, you know, you're free to live your life as long as it doesn't impinge upon mine and I'm free to live mine as long as it doesn't impinge upon yours.